Hi, my name is Vinnie Houston from Health Enhancement Fitness Equipment, and I'm going to demonstrate some of the stretches that can be performed with the AccuStretch. Starting out, I want you to sit at the end of the table with your knees off the end of the table. Lie back, bring your leg up, and it slowly advance the pad until you feel the stretch. Do not stretch if it's too painful. If you extend your toes, you'll feel the stretch more to the back of your hamstrings. If you flex it, you'll feel it more behind your knee. And just breathe easy. Press against the pad for five seconds. Relax and advance the pad more if you can. And then switch legs. Press against the pad, relax, and advance it if you can. It's common for one leg to be a little tighter than the other, so you may find that you could bring the pad a little more further forward for one side than the other. Bring the other leg back up, slide it across the pad. This is going to get a stretch all the way down into your hip, and a little twist of the foot to the outside, will also enhance the stretch for the whole IT band. Apply pressure for five seconds and relax. And switch legs. Slide the leg across, externally rotate, and breathe easy. You can massage the area where you feel it tight this will also increase the blood flow and help loosen up the muscles. Press against it for five seconds. One, two. And relax. There's no set time that you need to hold this. If you feel you want to hold it longer, you can do so. But we're going to move on to our next stretch. Bring your right leg back up. I want you to angle your leg at a slight angle the knee to the outside, and advance the pad some more. What you'll notice in this stretch is that your hamstring muscles come out independently. You can, so you can actually tell whether you're tighter on the outside, middle line, or medial side of your muscle. You can apply a little pressure with your hand to further enhance the stretch. You'll notice if you come down a slight inch or more, it will change the angle of the stretch, and you can advance it some more, and you may feel the stretch a little lower in the hamstring muscles. Again, massaging the muscle will also increase the blood flow and enhance the stretch. Bringing it down to a 90 degree angle will take the stretch off of the hamstrings and move it to the piriformis. Remember to breathe and relax as you're stretching. Release the pad and switch sides. Start out at a slight angle. Apply a little pressure with your hand. And you can again massage the muscle to help loosen it up. Press against the pad for five seconds. Relax. Drop it down a little bit to change the angle of the stretch. If you can, advance the pad a little more. One more big breath. And relax. Apply a little pressure. Bring the foot down to 90 degree angle. Next, slide your foot to the middle of the pad. Bring your other foot around. We can do a groin stretch. And you can apply pressure to the knees.
can also push against your hand. So I want you to push your knee against your hand and resist with your hand. One, two, three, four, five. Relax, other side. One, two, three, four, five. Relax. And you can also squeeze in against your hands. One, two, three, four, five. Relax. Doing this contract and relax techniques further enhances the stretch. Put one foot flat on the pad, let the other leg hang off the table, and again advance the pad. This is going to get buttocks of one leg and hip flexor of the other leg. If, if the leg hanging off the table, if you bring the heel back towards you, you'll also feel a stretch of the quadriceps. And switch legs. For a nice low back stretch with both feet on and bring your knees to your chest. Extend both legs, advance the pad a little more. This will get low back and both hamstrings again. Gonna roll over on our side for a groin stretch. Go completely on your side, put your leg on the side, and advance. Push against the pad. And relax. Switch sides. Breathe easy into the stretch. Roll over onto your stomach. This will be for the hip flexors. Extend the leg on the pad. and advance the pad if you can. And switch legs. Breathe nice and easy. Let, this, let your body release. Bring your knees down onto the table and put your toes on the pad for a quad stretch. You may feel a little stretch in your low back when you're doing this. And if you want to feel that a little bit more, you can very slowly come up on your elbows. This will also increase the stretch on the quadriceps, but also add a little stretch for your low back. And relax. Okay, hope you enjoyed using the Aki stretch. Uh, we'll have more on upper body stretches and our next feature.